first, we're talking soccer. The postseason is here, and boy, was it a fun start on Saturday. The game of the day was this one. Third-seeded Bismarck and sixth-seeded Mandan in a winner-takes-all showdown. The Braves would strike first. Jackson Schmidt, perfect feed to Andrew Catalano, who finishes it off in front for a first-half lead, 1-0. But the Demons would respond. Bamu Ramadani running through the defense. Slips one by to tie things up. This game would go the distance to a shootout. The finer kicker, final kicker for Bismarck, Liam Weiss, steps up to the plate and nets the game winner. 3-2 Bismarck in a shootout to advance to state. I mean, it's it was nervous. I know I've taken PKs before, and like earlier in the game when I like conceded a goal, pretty much it was just that was on the back of my mind, and I just had to shoot through it. I guess it was amazing. It was just crazy. I could not, I don't even believe it still. It was, it was amazing. The other state qualifier game, qualifier game featured Century against Jamestown. Four versus five seed. Century looking to strike quick in the first off the corner. A couple of great deflections by the goalie, but Parker Hoffa finds a rebound and finds the net. One nil Pats. They keep the pressure on through the half. This one from the far side, but Ryan Larson gets the fingertips on it for the save to keep it out of the net. Blue Jays looking for some scoring opportunities late. Scary collision near the net, but Abel Kramer staying aware, pokes it out. Sentry hangs on to win 2-1 to one to advance to state. Well, resiliency, I think, is the biggest thing. We have a lot of uh, competitive players, a lot of players that play year-round, um, and we haven't seen what we've wanted to see out of them the entire year, um, for the most part. And, and tonight, or today, they actually came out, and when something bad happened, they, they just formed together and they, they, they took care of business. So now that we know the teams, this is how the field is set for the state tournament. It all kicks off on Thursday afternoon with Century taking on top seed at Fargo Davies. The Eagles, the defending state champs, and haven't lost a game yet. Then it'll be Legacy facing West Fargo. The Sabres came up short in the WDA title game, so they'll be looking for a little first round revenge. On the other side of the bracket, it's Minot as the top seed from the West playing Red River and Bismarck facing off against the second seed from the East, West Fargo Cheyenne. 